How you to the man is the end. Welcome to Life of Spoon. Maybe you probably don't know this game. This is, I think, a sequel or a successor to a game called Lifeless Man, which was released a few years back. So, that game is pretty fun. I've played before. I don't remember all about it. I'm a Hindu game. I've been waiting for this game for a really long time. The Lifeless Man was really good, so I can't wait to see what's going on in this game. During the Cold War, two great superpowers sought to dominate the skies and space. So began a great space place as the Soviet Union and the United States spent billions attempting to fly further faster to the unknown. Okay, so this is during the Cold War. So during this time, there's dozens of test pilots died, sacrificing their lives to help to recover wish for the stars. So this is the story based on when they when people decided to go to the moon and try to land on the moon for the first time. Was it a fire jet? See what a fire jet the wall. It look cool. Or you can see it inside a jet as well. So, where, where are we going? They're really heating up. Oh, there we go. Oh, graveyard as well. Then we went to the player. To the first walk, I guess? Okay, that looks like a fire jet though. And now I went to the moon, though. This thing is really bad, though. Oh, what? Okay, now we have two astronauts. But to the moon. Okay, now we get the intro here. One disappeared, though. Looks like we got teleported somewhere, like to a, a web hole? So we're not on the moon? I guess we're not on the moon. Oh, this is the cool loading screen, though. I can actually change so we did get teleported to like another realm, I guess. Maybe we are, we're still on the boat. Yes, we still are. Where did we get teleported? Though? So I guess we can separate from our other... I guess partner? Where are we? So we're not playing the same guy, Lifeless Planet. Huh? It still feels familiar. It still feels familiar to the Lifeless Planet. Huh? Oh, wait. Huh? It's right here. Hello? Why is he do- What the hell? No worker. Huh? He disappeared though. Huh? He got teleported somewhere. This green thing though. Huh? No worker. Huh? How do you get to no worker? Huh? Okay, wait, and no. No worker. Huh? What is it? Eva. Let's pull the crater and locate your crewmate. Huh? Okay. Docs. Nothing in docs. Log. GEO. Geology notes. Okay. It's objectives. Huh? Documents, okay, that's easy to remember. Oh, this looks really like scarier than Lifeless Planet, actually. This is a horror game, by the way. I think at least. It's sort of like a, I think, suspense horror game. But it doesn't have jump scares, but it has creepy elements inside. I mean, hopefully this game doesn't have jump scares. I could kill less if it does. Oh, it's so dark down here. Okay, so he's still alive. Let's ask me speak it though. I can't tell. Look, oh there. Leading out of the crater. Okay. Why is he disappearing though? That's weird. Huh? Whoa. Hi. What is that? So it just appeared to say that. So it appeared from the ground though. Yeah. This wasn't here before, was it? Yeah. No, definitely not. Definitely not. Yeah. So the kind of cool, we have more dialogue. The last game didn't have that much dialogue. Huh? Now, now I have another cool way to go have like a lot of dialogue so it's good. Huh? It also calms down the horror a little bit. Huh? Yeah. Definitely to you. It's weird. Huh? So this happened. This. This is not after Lifeless Planet. This is like, I guess, before Lifeless Planet. Or is it even in the same universe? Or? I have no idea. So the story so far is two astronauts went onto the moon because they went to a space. It was going on a space race. Oh, what the hell! What was that? Oh. What the hell? Am I stepping on something? 
Put in the water. Ah, uh, okay. Whoa. It's very strange. Why is it keep doing that for? I just tap out something like that. What the sky? Something's really wrong here, partner. Yeah, I can see the same. I wish you talk with me. Yeah. Oh, so you can't talk, huh? What do you want to this guy? Is that how you usually look? Huh? I don't have space, he usually looks so. <laughs> I keep hitting shift to one, but it just stops for this stops you for one ego. Uh and Vivid delusion, mission anomaly. My brain is struggling to process what's going on here. My hearing sounds weird as it shouldn't be sound. Seeing an, an imaginable thing, and yet it all feels extremely real. I don't have any rational explanation for the events of the last hour hours. Pressing on as math method that's a big word. Medically as I can. I need to assign some kind of comms with Huston. Huston, that's his name. I've seen it completely well, I know. Huston? I think it's called. I'll feel a lot better if I can speak with Capcom. Capcom? <laughs> huh. If y'all know, y'all know. Oh god. Most of you probably know. Why? I think it's scaring me. Oh, there you go. Hey, what's up? Yeah, but why do you keep disappearing for? Are you an alien? Wait, he's a, an imposter. Okay, let me stop. What's it to you? How do you get to me See? The whole civilization down here. Did you even a store like a diner? I think they call it diner. Yeah, I can see a diner from fall. It feels so strange, yo. Wow. Chloe's diner. Yeah. Destroyed all the buildings at the edge of town. Seriously? We need people to leave you down here. Room. Yeah. So we found evidence of well, life. Here, wait, see. Okay. Oh, I didn't know I could get inside there. Well, what is going on? Why are you first person for? What is this? Like a little secret room. Like hey, I have save room side was the evil game. So. Uh. B. Oh, go down. Guess that's all. Look, I can pick with anything else at the moment, huh? Yeah, I'm guessing I just uh, like a secret room can fly out of the place. Huh? I guess you got a note somewhere. Machine shop. We were lucky. We were lucky that this shop was well stocked. A clean work area, tools. We were luckier than that shopkeeper was anyway. At least you can get that radio tower back online. Though it's not going to matter. We just need to call it up. That's all. Cause one message. I mean, maybe they'll get to us. I'll. Bring the shopkeeper's body back as thanks. Why would he do that? But that's all I can do for him. It's sad hunting, even working in a dead man's shop. We must press on or we will all be dead men. Or no one. So it must be when all the talent being destroyed. Or it's being destroyed. Sorry. So you can just automatically go anywhere? Well, of course, they're all accessible. So this looks like. We a school? It looks like a school. Wait. Hey. It's not a school though. Yeah, go to the back? I guess they need the lights turn out, we can go through there. Oh no. I guess you need a key for that, huh? Did we get a key? That for another building, oh. This is where the machine shop was, I think, oh. Right, so? Or this way the machine shop was. Yeah, but, oh no, let's play like a factory, I guess. So, it's not a factory, is it? No. But I keep me on top of it, so. It had like transportation as well on Earth, like motorcycles. I guess they had cars over here too. Did you just go? Just you go to this green spot here, follow this line here. We can't go back there. It's just being locked. Huh? I don't know. Uh, no book. Reversion attempt. Okay, near the several of us were unable to connect a power cable from the chamber to the device. We all know this is just grasping at straws, but the hope is we can flood the core with an opposite power flow. 
engineer postulates this will spark a kind of reversion effect, kicking off another iteration of the event. In the reverse, it's a terrible, dangerous idea. The only one we have right now that might restore the tower's location in space time. Oh, nothing else, okay. Wait, so that's like an objective one? We can follow this wire to connect it somehow. You said it in a notebook? I don't know what to mean. Look at this. Is it like a fire jet we saw at the beginning of the game? So have people landed here before that we didn't know? Or are these like completely like alien life? Well I'll find out though. Well I don't know if we are gonna find out anyway, so you know, last time it was aliens that was on a lifeless planet on the ground. It's called an underground lab. Well, on the title it was like for smooth for this game. That's what lifeless now is it? Such so underground lab for a way to restore power to the town. What type of here? Actually, no secrets. So, what's up right here? Notebook. Chamber door call. Current call for vacuum chamber door. One. X34. Well, I want times 34. I think we want X34. Activate with control room computer. Keep control room door locked. Oh, they're not any use. Okay. Okay, so you have to go to this little chamber here. Look at a vault. You just feel like a, in a bank, like a bank vault. Dr. Emily Watson. Yeah. Research scientist at the Muro Center. Okay, on so Monday, my engineer suggested wait, revising the power input. Somehow, this small modification initiated. Is it tape? I, oh, I thought it's a communication back to Earth. Event so. What's that? a teleportation device. Event. So you have a teleportation device now? Morag Flight Research Center Vacuum Chamber. Where do you put in the code though? Look at another note here. A lot of notes on this place. What new horror is this? I'm worried that the, the technician was on the break, break or a breakdown yesterday. But today I fear it is me who is falling apart. We were working in the vacuum chamber as as he was having me a tool. As his arm was covered in terrible blisters. I immediately thought back to my sister's last days. The body was still away in that dreadful hospital. Damn. That's, that's sad and grim. I uh, uh, let out a small shriek and dropped the experiment. He instinctively reached out to comfort me. I saw his skin was completely normal. I think about it now. The best scenario is that I was hallucinating. When I close my eyes, I see those awful soul like, and I can't shake the idea how his arm actually changed somehow. Dr. Emily Watson. That's the same person that is uh, that's talking to the table. I didn't even know he had a table. I thought I would communicate back to Earth, though. No? So my voice is a little funny, probably. The rocker. Whoa, what's over here? Look at this. What, fire over here? Or do these holes? Right there. Weapon angle. Oh, the lights back on. That's good, huh? I don't feel safe, though. Oh, the ladder go back down. That's good, too. Let's can climb up that little tower there. I'm not sure what it's called, huh? I hear the music starts kicking, you know. Does it sound good, though? I don't know. When the music starts kicking, kicking inside these type of games, it just feels like something's gonna bad's gonna happen. Like the enemy gonna pop up somewhere. Else. Drop him. Not cut scene. What are we looking at though? Oh, no, 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 it's just okay. That's a weird cut scene. Oh, there is no over here. I think. Yeah. From dreams. I delayed writing this entry for three days, but I can't ignore it anymore. I keep experiencing the most inexplicable thing. But objects I dream about keep appearing to me after I wake. Last week I dreamed I was back in our living room. Something exceptional. But in my dream, I noticed a small blue vase that sat on the end table. A couple hours after I woke up, I saw it again right here in this room. I didn't know how to react, so I called to the biologist to confirm that I was really seeing the, uh, this object in the real world. When I turned back around, it was gone. This scenario has repeated itself two more times since. Well, recently I had dreamed about my old coin collection. When I woke up, I consciously raised my hand and I opened my palm. Somehow in my gut. My gut, what the hell? 
I know like uh, I would see if there was a coin for my dreams and yet a moment later that eternal token badge from my hand in a shower woman like sparks. Dr. Emily Watson, uh, the same doctor. It's very strange. So it's like they were experimenting with a few things and they were beginning to change like hallucinations and weird dreams. So, so hmm, it's very interesting. Alright, back in the city. Now let's turn back on. Just good. Don't like these, like, to turn inside. So, here you go now. Can you go to the diner? There's a radio at 9 AM. There you go. Go inside. I know it's like, there you go then. We go back to this machine shop. Oh, we can go back. Can you drive this car, please? You know, this might be a prequel to. Lifeless planet. Cause I was thinking like lifeless planet looked like more futuristic, huh? to me at least. So huh? it kind of strange because I think I remember that game ending on like cliffhanger. Huh? Yeah, that game ending like a sort of cliffhanger. So I don't know why they did they decided to do like a prequel if it if this is a prequel anyway. So guys, what I would have thought is is that lifeless moon is gonna start why will lifeless planet end but ended, but that didn't happen. Huh? So I guess you can't go anywhere else except for on top of here. Huh? Let's go. Oh, please. Whoa. Little weirdo. Glitching out. I see. Can't climb. Alright, how do we get off here? Okay. Alright, let's see. Did I jump back? Alright, oh, so. Why me a little nightmare? So. Alright, let's go. Go. This is all magic to us. So how do you? Oh, there you go. A little weird now. Inventory. Key. Oh, I know that goes. I go to school, right? So, oh, why don't you can escape for? Escape to do like all that. All the like menus I'll call it. But I keep putting some pop menu you instead. Ah, uh, I need to get back to school because this could be slow. All right, here we go. Let's go inside, huh? Just inside a school lockers. Watch places. Little cutscene. It's only a little cutscene every single time we enter some place. So, classroom here. Tears falling over. That's not good. Huh? Well, let's go. Look like we have the Nazi students over here. Yeah, lockers like inside the wall. It's like, kind of strange. These lockers are like out and in the open. Now it's inside the wall. Wait, hold up. Oh, that's weird. Huh? Look at the fourth wall. It's something that yeah, it always like third person game. You can just do that. Huh? I don't know if the I don't know if the the team is like aware of that though. Why the hell they're falling for? Hello, you magic chair. Are you going to drop down? That must be. So this must be a teleportation device. But it's an elevator. Hold up. I I'll explain this down. The elevate and then it just disappears and it teleports to somewhere else. Let me have it to our player, our partner, right? But see our player. Uh, first of all, let's just say, um, yeah, the hoop is kind of missing, you know? It's still kind of old and any basketball anywhere. Oh, there's more. Um, well, as hoop is missing too. Tell me you're yeah. This. yeah, I am. They are? Well, why was he do that? Huh? Oh, seal kill over here? Oh, the research scientists fight a teleportation event, huh? Wait, were they just testing people all along? And they just put them here? So higher, I guess maybe this was a batting before the old city was batting? That, that makes no sense. It kind of does. So. Disaster. Hey, Lower. I'm sorry about how we left things last week. So my work here will be done. I really can't take a trip somewhere nice. Let's see you and me. I think of this desert. Huh? Desert? Huh? What do you mean, desert? The moon is. Not like a desert. Sorry. Sick of working so hard for this, for this obsessive, uptight engineer and scientist. Missed my deal. Ah, uh, okay, stop. Ah, uh, well, I told you it's a horror game. This is your first bit of horror, I guess. Okay, this is how I think it's supposed to be. Like, like this power is creepy. The creepy stuff. And that's how you're going to be for this game as well, I think. Alright, I hate to say it's all making sense, but. 
has got mean? to be related to that huge explosion out in the desert a couple years ago. Yes, the moon. Experiment at the research center destroyed half the town and killed a bunch of people. Remember? That's strange. They never I don't found recall. anything except the huge crater in the ground. Huh. Well, if my eyes are not deceiving me, the explosion wasn't really an explosion, but what do you mean, some huh? kind of teleportation event that just oh, okay. everything to the moon. That's strange. Huh? They just like everything to the moon. Oh, so all of this was actually buildings and cities from Earth, huh? and it translated from to here. So I'm guessing some people experiment teleportation device and I stole some stuff from Earth, huh? huh. The cutscenes. I don't know if you keep the cutscenes of the video or not. Huh? That shadow skill life on me. <laughs> what the hell is that? You can have a pig on? Yes, you can. We have a little kid. We. We. Come on. One. Oh, very strange. Why do you have holes? Like, a big hole. Like, any small chicken just fall into the hole that you can get them out of? Huh? Well, aside, I guess. Reverse single. Where else do when you were a child just end it up just flat up the side of this? I know I know you have. If you haven't, you lie, go. If you truly have then you're missing out on. Okay, I'm gonna get mad because of that. But that's, it's your choice, not mine. Wait, do you believe this? I, I can't even read this, so huh? scale of frozen bodies in this school, I can't imagine the pain that these poor souls experience. Suffocation. They could push sickness for anyone lucky enough to survive. There must be more. Somewhere I haven't Found the bodies. Huh? Wait, what? I haven't found. Oh, I haven't found their bodies. Could they have been in through any of this? I'll keep looking. Their families deserve answers. Huh? Definitely. Even they're still still alive. Huh? Yeah, I guess these bodies are still alive inside the Earth. Huh? This, 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 all this was on the Earth apparently. It's all teleported here. Very strange. Huh? I mean, we know that humans can't like. Survive in space that's like an astronaut suit as you have on right now. They don't get what's going on. It's a light there. I'm gonna go towards it. Huh? We're not going to the same place. No, we're not. Huh? Let's go over here. Oh, big massive hole over here. Look how meteorite just falling to here. Maybe you did. Huh? Maybe you just was like digging down here. Just go down here in the first place. Huh? Slip through, I guess. Huh? How do you slip through, anyways? Huh? We can't. Huh? We have put this gate somehow. So, do I have a desk? So, I can't interact with this. So, there's a whole bunch of places. Huh? If you go beyond here, I guess it's gonna hit the visible wall somewhere. This looks pretty. This looks pretty nice. Look at space. I'm always interested in space as a, as a little kid. Huh? You can go pretty far, you know. Where can we go? I guess in where this light spot, yeah, you can see like a visible wall here. But it's kind of strange, you can, can kind of see it. I don't know if that by accident or how it meant to be. Oh, I don't know, no I don't know, I can't have a notebook. Amy Fault in 38. Oh, that's supposed to be when he died. Barry Dales 44, Gerald Douglas 81, Freddy Kindle 31, Sarah Huggers 36, John and John Spring 58, 54, Vio. What's Vio stand for? Rebecca Spring 3. That's very young. What the hell? Janet Calderwood 37, Jane Doe Unknown. I personally was only 3 years old. And then a lot of you was young 28, 31, 44. The only like I feel like long was 81 or 67. But still was just like young still. 58, 54, I still still too young to pass away. Wait, I guess we hear smell. Oh, it's locked, huh? Maybe last week I entered this vault over here. Let's go. Go. You were here, a notebook, huh? A uh, note, huh? There's this lava a cavity. This lava tube provided a cavity for the vacuum chamber. It is far more fortunate than most areas that became fused into the rocks during the teleportation event. The people in those sections, I guess, they are statues now. Dr. Emily Grant Center. No, not over here. I'm done cleaning up your messes. A janitor is still a person, not an experiment. You sent me to a gray desert? You want me to grasp for, for air? Why? I will never forget the smell. Like a black. Charcoal. I'm never going back there. I quit SC. Damn. 
Look, it's a key right here. Of course, I missed something. It was so obvious as well. Let me tell you. Is it? No. Oh, the dino. Yes, yes, yes. Go to dino. I give you the escape sign. Time to get something to eat. Well, everything there probably is spoiled anyways, so I guess you can't eat anything. Alright, here we go. Let's go. Come on. Do it, There we go. A little bell there. Where? I am first person. What am I in the first person for? This dino. So cool. Anyway, so. Where do you go from here? Coffee there? Why can't you like a space here? Oh, you can move. Huh? This is strange here. This is kind of mechanical. I think they on full. It's still over here. Oh, what is musical? Slowest bulletin board. Huh? Your bulletin board. Keep pushing stuff out the main area. Okay. I can do most odd job I do them find masks. Oh, I don't know. I could the IWQ at radio station. Safe storage, protect your edges 81 slash months. As you 80 slash months. Work nuts bank. bank. Now hiring dishwasher. There's a whole bunch of stuff. I'm not going to read all this. Okay, that's just like probably a CEO of this place. He's cute as dining area clean. Blah, blah. He's watching. Do I discuss plans outside the vacuum chamber? That's interesting. Bro. I kind of weird as well. Creepy. There's like, something about a fire jet, so. Weird. No match blood quarter. Can you pick up all these? Oh, you can't pick up all these, but I'll say. Anyways. So, what's his diner? A whole bunch of stuff. I, I can't see it, huh? I want to see the menu. Here, exactly, though. Blood Dame Bitter. I mean, he looks like a normal human, so I guess he was did like live here and adapt here. But did he was like end up adapting to these environments? Kind of weird if they did because he will kind of really live on the moon and live in space in general without getting killed or without an astronaut suit. Where do you go now? What is this? Oh, it's the menu. It's the way. All rock backwards. Bacon egg. Bacon? That's how I am, bro. Come on, that's just, that's a beef bacon. Ah, uh, ham and ham. Come on, I have two. Ham and cheese omelet. Half pounds. Uh, stack of pancakes, French toast, toast or toast or biscuit and jelly. Well, nice salad sides. Crispy fried chili cheese fried. And we all just just go skim through it. Are you know, I can't eat. Yeah, whatever. Mercury way dessert. So that sounds good actually. Well, I think it's really annoying. Can you stop, please? Okay, where else can you go? What? The? Hi. Hello. You're not the same guy. You're not the partner. Who are you? Commander. Are you, to... you should I commander? never let me fly that day. You knew I what? wasn't ready. Oh, the plane exploded. Hi. What the hell? Let's just pull away now. Yeah, totally creepy. Mysterious. That's really weird. Anyways, that sounds different. They actually get out of it. Okay, I'm done. That shop. What do you do? I'm welcoming you, Yuri. I think it's time to lose my mind. I see you lose anything. Why does he materialize from a. I have a watch as he materialized from a million tiny strands. A tangle of filaments. Something before my very eyes. It's possible. He died at a test flight a year ago. I will never forget the trauma of that terrible day. This was a hero. The man is playing tricks on me. Maybe I could actually believe that if I were not holding my heart a very real key. My dead friend left behind. Also, he did get a key. Only for the last couple of hours, I have been visiting of my crewmate from the moon lander. But the familiar space suit has also taken a stable form. Each time I see his body appears to assemble and disassemble in a deeply assigned display. I held out hope that my fellow astronaut was still alive. Now that I've seen it, then family reanimated the same way. I wonder if any of this is real. Also, our partner might not still be alive. It must be our hallucination. So. It doesn't make you feel comfortable though. Come on, I want to have another partner with us in a condition. 
Let's say I, I was a hallucination. Let's say that was actually real. That was. Wait, was that V hit there before? That V was not there before, was it? Maybe it was. I have no idea. Let's say that was a hallucination, by the way. How could that be real? What if he, like, they all teleport over here somehow? The explosion. So we are the commando. That's kind of weird, though. Wait, wait. Is the key not for this, though? Do we even have a key in the first place? No. Oh, this is why this was here. Wait. Some call. That fire jet that we, that we saw, that was must have been his fire jet that exploded and landed here. So maybe he was here the whole time. Where did he get the key? So let's go back to the diner, I guess. So, there you go, I have a key now. Oh. Ah, uh, the control room. We know that goes. There's a fire jet right here. Once you see fire jet, fire jet that exploded. But how did it end up here? Outside. Today, the long is crazy. Okay. Yeah, put those again. Explosion of light. Okay. We experienced a severe shock wave that momentarily knocked everyone unconscious. What the hell we do? I question my sanity as I say these words. Interesting. The entire research center and most of the town are no longer located on Earth. Oh wait, so this is when all the talent, the town of Earth just disappeared. Huh? This is the town we are in now. A, A, B, B, A, high team higher. Marco OS 1.12 comma. All this is not alive. Power of secrets activated ready. Chamber operation nominal. Open attach closed door with, 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 with console controls. I think we should answer. Okay. Okay. Make sure you enter. What's this? So? NTL's can do it here. Let me just click it. The one over here. There you go, that though. Very short for me though. So, what does that do now? I guess you put this over here. There you go. So, do we need two more? I'm gonna light this up. So, it was 1x34. So. What was happening? What was happening? What is this up? This thing? This thing just happened, though. It's like over here, though. Oh, it did. What's this? What did he get? Huh? What's the code? Oh, the egg was doing that's the one you do light up. Huh? Interesting. Huh? This is a teleportation device. They look, they look familiar. So like this planet, huh? I don't have time to explain yeah. now, but we found a device that could okay. be our way of escape. Oh, it's back to us. To the generator here inside the vacuum chamber. Oh, okay. The door should be strong enough to keep him out. Who else? Let's huh? get to the caves. We're going in. Huh? All right. Huh? How do we? How do we power this door? Can we power this door? I think I have to do a note. I think. Huh? Oh, it's some of these are like. How do you be allowed huh? already? That's really that. Huh? It's like a light like huh? it's So, can you power this thing anyways? I don't think so. This guy, I guess. I guess you can't power this thing. Huh? Uh, let's go to this crate, I guess. I guess you can open the door. Okay. Be of hard landing. Huh? No? Can't power this door over here. Nothing? Let's see, go. Get back, huh? There you go. That's working, go. Let's go down. Go by the lawyer's screen, huh? Down to a cave area, I guess, huh? You're digging down to see what's going on. It's the moon area. That sounds weird. Moon area. Yeah. Then going over here, too. We're going out green stuff over right here. Whoa, that's really a teleportation device, huh? That's look really cool, though. Let's go up, I guess. Huh? Are you doing over here? That's not. Huh? Let's go up. Huh? 
The walk here, go. That's really cool. Is he over here missing? No. Wait, we'll go into a basket. Life's a smooth, no? It's an intro, I guess, so. It's very interesting. But biologist, so. Okay. Okay, so she will get teleported to. It's just the, um, the chapter now. Well, that's weird, though. Hey, are you yeah. with me? Yeah, with you. I thought I saw you there for a minute. Yeah, yeah, I did it. No, no, I've lost you again. Great, huh? Look, I don't know if you can see or hear me, but I'm going to scout up ahead. Okay. See if there's a way out of these caves. Okay. Really weird. Something's here. It's very sparking. Anyway, I think it's a good spot to end this episode here. Thank you guys for watching. I will try to upload this game every single day. If not every other day, I'll try. Be sure to like and subscribe for more Lifeless Moon. And yeah, have a nice day and bye.